All right, hello everyone. My name is Crystal Ambrose, also known as Crystal Ocean, and I'm here to talk trash. So get this, every year, eight million tons of plastic debris enter all the world's oceans. This is equivalent to one dump truck filled with plastic being dumped into the sea every minute. Marine wildlife like turtles, seabirds, and whales feel the wrath of this plastic debris as they either ingest the material or become entangled within it, thus leading to their death. With the help of winds, tides, and currents, plastic debris travels the world's oceans on an open ticket and maroons itself on the most beautiful beaches of the world. I mean, my goodness, what a life, right? Now, developed nations tend to be the primary producers of most of this plastic waste. However, it's small island developing states like the Bahamas, where I'm from, who act as sinks for this plastic debris and are forced to clean it up, which is totally unfair. But only if there was a way to determine where this debris was coming from to make cleanup efforts easier. Hmm. Aha! Here's where my work comes in. I'm using predictive mapping to look at how plastic moves around the islands of the Bahamas over space and over time, and assessing the impacts of this debris on the health of our marine ecosystems and our economy. Using data that I've already gathered on plastic debris abundance on Bahamian beaches, I'll be using GIS mapping and modeling software to determine the likelihood of debris deposition based on the geography of the coastline. The predictive mapping data will be analyzed using the latest visual analytic techniques and will communicate how currents like the Gulf Stream and those of the Atlantic Ocean help influence debris landings. So you see, predictive mapping is cool, right? It can be used to determine debris source and accumulations and can serve as a mitigation tool to help improve and enhance marine debris removal efforts in the Bahamas. You see, paradise isn't perfect. In fact, paradise is polluted by plastic. So the next time you use a plastic straw or a plastic bag, I want you to think about my ocean paradise and the role that you play in polluting it. Refuse to use single-use plastic items today, like right now, like when you walk out the door, I'm like, stop. <laughs> All right, thank you guys so much for your time. Yeah.